wants to. Ah! <laughs> Yo, let me tell you something. I feel like a virgin that just lost her, just got her chair popped. Right now, man, I have never, <laughs> I have never, in, out of all these years, man, <laughs> out of all these years of making fun of this company and their productions, I've never seen an Asylum movie. Oh, but y'all might have heard of things like snakes on a plane, and they're like, oh, you know what? That sounds cool, man. You may, maybe, maybe somebody will be dumb enough to confuse it with our movie, Snakes on a Train. God damn. What the angry. Venomous snakes. Oh. <laughs> Damn, just in case you didn't ass, know. The cheap ass stock footage of an Amtrak going by. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, that sound. Yeah. yeah. Somebody saying bye to their mama and they got off the train. <laughs> <laughs> so bad. Hey, kid. You love the Transformers? Well, I hope your grandma walks in Walmart and reaches to the bottom of the barrel and gets for you Transmorphers. Take our planet back. Get the hell out of there. It's a trap. Repeat. It's a I thought that was your brother at first. Yeah, I, <laughs> <laughs> I thought that. I was like, damn, your brother's everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Asylum's amazing, man. Because, like I said, Asylum, they got no shame, got no f at all, man. They, they, I, I, I got to tell you. They got no shame and no game. <laughs> uh, I, I think they got plenty of game though. That's the that's the thing, Martin. I looked at I looked at all this bullshit that they were doing. <laughs> Snakes. <laughs> you would look at something like this. The snakes on a train. <laughs> <laughs> You know, normally Ooh, that's cheap. somebody would look at some cheap shit like that <laughs> and be like, this company, whoever whoever made this, this is the worst company I've ever seen. You, sir, have no shame. You have no respect for art or cinema. But then I watched something today, or actually a couple of days ago, I watched something this weekend, and I got to tell you, and I mean it. I have never seen a silent movie, and maybe that's the problem. You know, I, I I just I didn't see it in the beginning, but now that they made all these movies, and I'm watching this right now, I think they are an incredible company. I think that they they that yes, they are shitty, <laughs> they are shameless, but they are cold and calculating about that <laughs> shit to a T. There is that. <laughs> Do, I have never seen somebody do rip-offs as carefully and as okay. brilliantly oh, okay. as they do. Again, they calculate everything out. A lot of times, we ain't even got a movie to f <laughs> <laughs> They and, just and know I, I it's on what, the way. I'm looking at, at CNN Business. It says, this studio never loses money. Well, I can believe that. And I hope they never will. You know, a lot of people, they heard that we were going to be doing uh, this movie, Homeward. They're like, man, didn't y'all already do that movie? Y'all removed, y'all reviewed that movie about two weeks ago, didn't you? Morning, mom. Hey, birthday boy. By the laws of yore, I must dub thee a man today. Kneel before me. That's okay. I have a gift from your dad. No, dumbass. That's onward. <laughs> the movie that we're talking about today. Let me see if I can find it right here. The movie that we're talking about today, and I'll find the box for you. I can understand how you can be confused. We're talking about <laughs> Homeward. <laughs> looks, looks way different. What are you talking about? <laughs> and I saw this today. This being my first one, I'm going to show you just how cold and calculating they are point by point. Of course, you can see right there that, yes, this is a ripoff of the movie Onward. But you can clearly see in the trailer that they put out. Like I said, they ain't, we don't care. We ain't got nothing to hide. Maximus Copius! <laughs> don't you do it! No biscuits! I like cool! Oh, oh, yeah, oh, yeah he, almost, he was just sort of doing that, wasn't he? Yeah, you, that's one of the things about 
about asylum, even even as cheap as they are, you're surprised to know that they even got D list talent. They, they even got Joe, I was like, they got Joey Lawrence. Right. Joey wow. Lawrence. I, I, I'm not kidding. I went, oh, that's Joey Lawrence. Wait, what the f do I care? Yes. <laughs> oh, hell no. Nah. Hey, oh, hell yes. To get into this movie right here, let me see if I can uh, get to one of my my screens here. So to, to get into the movie right here, uh, even before the movie starts, it's already doing the world a service by telling you burning questions, you know, the answers to burning questions that you may have. We already learned one about Joy Lawrence. Where is he? He's yeah. doing <laughs> homework. Do you know what That's what he's doing. When he's not doing he's porn. Not doing porn. <laughs> uh, <laughs> is Joey Lawrence in rehab? Oh, psh, he wishes. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> he's doing his, all his homework shit. He's like, I got to get a drug problem so I get out of this. <laughs> yeah. No, he's at the asylum. <laughs> no, like, no, the asylum. Not, yeah, yeah, not yeah, a yeah. asylum, the asylum. Oh, <laughs> he'd be better off in a straight jacket right yeah. now. <laughs> but they also, you know, like I said, they answer some burning questions out there like, uh, like this one. During the opening credits, you see, hey, what happened to Tom Green? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Tom Green, he's making asylum movies right now. <sighs> he's one of the stars in Homeward. There he is right there. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> For those of you who don't recognize this man right here, I know some people <laughs> Which like, is everybody. I, <laughs> some people I like, who's fucking dad is that? Yeah, yeah. For those of you who don't recognize this guy, including Tom yeah, Green. Yeah, including Tom Green. He's looking in the mirror right now, yeah. huh? Like, what the Who are you? <laughs> what happened to me? In case you're wondering, yeah, who the f dad is that? He look like he's he like some dad that just came to pick them up from like <laughs> high school or something. You ready to go, son? Your mom said it's my weekend. <laughs> <laughs> it's my weekend. He, he's he's got that look where he's like, wait, so you're you're transitioning now? <laughs> oh. <laughs> for those of you who don't remember Tom Green, this might be a a harsh refresher for you. Oh, that. Guy. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Right when they start to show characters in the film, they want to make sure that these kids are con stay confused. You know, like I said, if this is something that you, you, your grandma got for you, thinking that she was picking up the latest Pixar movie, they want the kids to like not ask any questions because the first character that you see in the movie is a purple elf. Ugh. And at that moment, the kid, you know, if you're like a six year old, you don't know what the happening you like you might be like well I, I i i guess it's one of those characters from the movie i i, I don't i don't know what's real anymore right <laughs> you know? it looks close enough it looks close enough you immediately see how bad the animation is <laughs> <laughs> they don't try to hide they don't try to fool you with good animation in the beginning no the it's beginning, one way you wait, see wait, this shit go oh, copy and paste <laughs> and their feet are not touching the ground they're not touch they're what floating you, what do you say what? martin said he's not touching the ground <laughs> let me see Copy and paste. Look at this <laughs> shit. So bad. Ain't making no contact with that ground whatsoever. It looks like there's no still... gravity whatsoever. None. No, what they do is, man, they uh they 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 they, they want to show you just how bad this shit looks, but they are smart about it. Because the moment that your kid starts to record, even a kid can understand, like, okay, this ain't no Pixar Disney shit. This this, <laughs> this okay. cheap ass shit. Yeah. This is garbage. I ain't stupid. All right. I may be five, but I ain't stupid. That's when a kid goes and tells their mommy, look, you would slap me if you want to, but you tell grandma, you tell that bitch, I ain't stupid, okay? Don't bring that shit uh, over Don't bring no that more. shit over here again. I ain't dumb. I don't bring fuck, I might be six year old, but I ain't stupid. In fact, what grandma, I call her, bitch, I ain't dumb. I know there's some bullshit here. I know you paid $5 for this. I asked you for Pixar, not asylum. But the moment that you start to probably get mad about it, they, they know what to do. They know how to throw. They know, they know how to throw things at kids okay. to make them go like, "Man, this is some oh." Because right when the animation starts getting shitty, they be like, "You know what? Superheroes. They make these motherfuckers fly." Look at this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they know yeah. kids love superheroes, man. They turn these elves into <laughs> Iron Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we gonna throw some Avengers shit in there. Look at that. <laughs> they know exactly what they're doing. Yeah, so, uh, elves, asylum. Asylum Assemble! Yeah. <laughs> Those orcs are still floating. They still floating. <laughs> they just still running. They just want to cash in, lure people in on the box with, well, with the box art. They want to fool people. They want to give a, a false premise out there, making, making them think it was going to be a, an onward ripoff. But they're kind of doing their own thing. They got these battles going on. Okay, this is going to be a, uh, a, a medieval fantasy. 
They're not going anywhere near that. It's kind of wrong to lure people in like that, but at least you're doing your own thing. Asylum said, bitch, do you know who we are? Yeah, I you're don't... fucking playing. This ain't no game. We, we don't do our own thing. We do your thing and your <laughs> thing. And, and some of your yeah, yeah, and, and by don't hide, we go f*** your thing up completely <laughs> since you're trying to run. We don't do the five, <laughs> five minutes into the movie. They went to the modern world. I was like, oh, okay, here we go. Ah, here all right, go. all right. Welcome all to Elfdale right. High School. <laughs> That's the asylum I heard about right there. Got you. All right. I'd rather you got me. The movie, the story actually opens up in a gym, and they could give a f less. They use, <laughs> they use all the basic shapes in that 3D program right there. <laughs> Boy, you ain't lying. I, they, they use every free model that you can find that off can the find. internet for this. Ain't yeah. no texture or anything. Love it. It's like Home Depot just set all that brand new equipment up today. Boy, ain't no corrode in here. They, they, they sterilize like a mother. Yeah, ain't no dust or nothing. Ain't nothing dirty. In the middle of a gym. In the so middle you know of a gym. Cheap. It's like, it already existed. Pristine. They don't care. And 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 look down in the corner where they 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 have they expect the kids to sit on lawn chairs. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, plastic yeah. lawn chairs. Them plastic ass chairs. You Man, get. we got some chairs like that outside. Right yeah. Now. yeah. <laughs> so this this is where we get introduced to. This is where we get introduced to. Uh, our main character here, our main character of uh, Barl, and Barl. Now remember, Bar remember, remember no, hold remember, on, I'm saying because I know you're gonna say, hold on, Barl, because I'm gonna say it. Hold on, Barl. Okay. Barl is an orc who goes to an elf high school. Apparently, he was uh, adopted or something. They don't give you no backstory, you know. They, they, just, they say it in the trailer. I guess it's all, no, I guess it's all you they, need to know. Yeah, they just say he's a he's an orc uh, going to an elf high school, and the thing with and he hangs out with some goth chick. They don't really explain why, because he ain't cool. You know, ain't nothing. You know, he's not. He's not like. In fact, people seem not not even like him. But he's hanging out with the hottest chick, Jesus. the goth chick at the school. But the thing with the, uh, <laughs> the thing with Barl, you know, oh, let me see if I can find it here. And the thing with Barl is that Barl, he's a. Uh, he wants to pull a prank on his brother, but I'll get to that in a little bit. <laughs> it's fucked. It's fuck, It's real. Fucked up. It's real. Fucked up. But before you even get to this part here, you look at you're looking at Barl and you're saying, "Hey, man." Don't I know you from somewhere? I've seen you before. No, 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 no. Wait a minute. You in Wrecked Ralph. What happened oh, to you, man? Oh, <laughs> that's right. Asylum well, said, you know what? While I'm up here robbing Pixar, Disney's right next door. Yeah, I'm going to yeah. take your shit, too. <laughs> that's right. I'm going to crawl through your window and yeah. steal your shit, too. <laughs> Martin, is that what you going to mention right here? No, I wasn't going to mention that. Uh, I mean, that's a good point because the, the the voice actor sounds like like a like a discount John C. Riley. No, I was going to bring up the fact that okay, yeah, he's he's Wrecked Ralph, but he's also clearly modeled on the character from Onward, whose name is Barley. I didn't even they, I didn't even remember that, Martin. Yeah, the, the the character he's ripped off from his name Barley, and they just went, well, let's just take the Y off. Wow, and his name is Barl. lazy oh. as. They don't even get. The, they don't do nothing original. They didn't even try to get an original name. Man, <laughs> they said, "Hey, you, all we know is y'all heard the name Barley in the trailer, and we gonna take that shit Barl. too." <laughs> Why? Cause we dick riding hard. <laughs> and thing with Barl is that <laughs> Barl is funny, man. Barl's. I talked about how he looked like Wreck and Ralph. Barl is a bigger asshole than Ralph. Barl's supposed to be the sympathetic character. He's the one having a hard time because, you know, he's the orc in the elf's land. Mm. But the thing with Barl is that Barl wants to play a prank on his brother. Brother didn't do shit to him. <laughs> and now you think a prank is just kind of like, you know, I'm going to, you know, I don't know, man. I'm going to jump out of a corner and say boo. Or I'm going to, you know, maybe tape a kick me sign in the back of your son. No, Barl wants to dump slime on, on, on his brother. And oh, not just oh. regular slime, but boiling slime. You hear that shit cooking? Oh, yeah. Oh. So he wants to pull a carry on him? Yeah. It, it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he exactly, wants to pull a carry exactly. on him. Exactly. And, and, and the thing is, he doesn't want to just do it like uh, any day of the week. He wants to wait till his brother is on stage in front of everybody giving his valedictorian on his, gradu oh, graduate, on his graduation. On his graduation. Asshole, man. And that's the... And and that's the shit that you boiling that, slime, boil, 
boiling slime. You hear that shit? Like it was like a cauldron. Does he explain why he wants to do it? Because he's an asshole. He just says, I like playing pranks on my brother. And the shit, yeah, yeah you're right. <laughs> that's, the, that's the kind of shit that you do to Carrie, man. Yeah. They did that shit to her. Yeah, they go. Like, yeah. And you see what happened to them. And see what happened to her. Yeah, it, was like, yeah, it didn't work out too well for them. And it's funny, too, because the characters in the movie, like, they even, they know that shit is fucked up. They just kind of like, because what you do is, man, pouring boiling slime on somebody, they do that to somebody you hate, not to mm-hmm. somebody you love. Right, he, right. Because Borrow says, I love my brother. This, this chick even says, wait a minute, I, I, thought, I, I thought you loved your brother. It's the best prank ever. <laughs> what? Boiling his ass alive I mean, yeah, with yeah. slime? But, but the thing about it is, is she's like, the pranks on him, and it's a <laughs> shitty thing to do. And it's his, Your val- point. It's, it's his big day on graduation day. Your point, you stupid, you, you gothic bitch. Whatever, your funeral. Yeah. Sit my milk. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it, it already establishes something that, that Barl has one friend, and it's a girl that clearly has nothing but contempt for him. Right, exactly. Yes. And you wonder why. She couldn't care less for him. You know, he's an orc. And even people are saying, uh, you know, I like like this Tilda Swinton looking bitch right here. She said here, she oh. said, <laughs> oh god. She says here, this 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 elf chick, she says, you know, I thought if elks, if if, if elves and orcs are supposed to get along with each other, then then, then where is uh where's where's Barl? Why is Barl yeah, never doing what, what Yeah, why yeah, why is Barl never why is he never doing what, what people are supposed to do in school? If orcs and elves get along so well, then why is the only orc that goes to this school not here? Doing what all orcs do, getting into trouble. <laughs> you know, um, they, you know they, 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 call, bar, they call Barl a nigga behind his back. Basically, doing what all, all lazy ass orcs do. <laughs> you're doing smoking what those people do. do. Stealing you know, cars, you're, you're smoking right about weed, that you know, no even, good. What's that, Martin? Well, even when she asked that question, I was like, in the real question is that if elves and orcs are supposed to get along, why do we only have one orc at this school? Yeah, they like, never right. answer like, is yeah. he adopted? Why, why is he with his family? They but, but I'm saying like the new- in a, their integration program is a fail. <laughs> they only got one orc. Separate but equal. But no, but um, <laughs> do they yeah, have exactly. orcs in the land? Yeah, they no, they got their own land. The elves have their, oh, the orcs have their Ain't own no land. Ain't no orcs in this in this land but Barl, and Barl is f***ing up. But they're not supposed to get along then. They, they no, they're they're fine. You know, you know. <laughs> I mean, clearly the, the government uh, the the governor forced them to have an orc at that school, and it's, they're like, yeah, all right, we check the box. We got one C rated. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, that's some good magic, man. Yeah, that looks a little creepy. That whole that's because, and it's funny. That is principle. Tom Green right there. Oh, jeez. Get it? For one, he's green. Yeah. Oh, and, God. And, he, and, and it's funny because it doesn't sound like Tom Green for anybody who actually remembers Tom Green. Mm-hmm. If you don't, then, hey, cool. Good, no, good, for, <laughs> yeah, you. good, good for, for you. Good for you. Good for you. <laughs> but for, for those who know Tom Green, it's funny because <clears throat> they have him with big eyes like Tom Green. They have him acting like Tom Green, but he ain't telling a joke. So imagine if Tom Green wasn't trying to be funny and he was still doing things that Tom Green do. He's like, out of all the out of all the lazy animation in here, this mother is the most animated. Croon University. I'm so proud. You know, I was a graduate of Croon University. You know what I'm you hear me? Yeah, I know. Say something. Say something about my college, bitch. Look at here. I dare you. Eventually Lloyd finds out about this prank that's about to happen. <laughs> And he's tired. He is sick and tired of borrowed shit. <laughs> tired of it. And he says, "Listen, man. He's like, you know, we we can't we can't do this no more. <laughs> can't we you can't know. with you no more." But he actually tells me like, but he doesn't. He says, "I can't tell him that because you know he's gonna. If I tell him that, you know, I'm about to kill his ass and he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna run or something." No, he tells him. <laughs> no, he just says, "Hey, look." He says, look, man. He says, how can I get I, I love my brother. I don't, you know, I, I, I gotta deal with his ass. You know, we we uh we've been raised together. You know, I I I, I love my, my my big orc brother. But he says I gotta do something with him. And he's gonna destroy my one day. My one day. <laughs> destroy my, my, my one, my graduation day. He says, listen, uh, 
Hey, let's uh, let, let's go for a ride, Bar. <laughs> and, 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 <laughs> I tell you what, you you drive almost in the back seat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, think about the think about all the pretty bunnies and the pastures and the <laughs> <laughs> what's that, Lenny? <laughs> It, it is like it, it's a lot like when when you drive a, a dog out to the woods and let him go and then yeah. hop back in the car and drive off. And now we the thing is we're joking, but as cool as Lloyd's trying to be, Lloyd can't Lloyd can't hide that shit. Mm-hmm. And you and it looked for a while you thinking is Lloyd actually about to go kill this mother? You really right. think so, man? This is super yeah. fun. Oh <laughs> shit! Bitch, I'll kill you. This is t- <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just keep having a good time there, Barl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> in this movie, man, you are gonna learn that copy and paste is their best friend. <laughs> First thing you see is those f-ed up eyebrows, copied, pasted, and flipped. Oh shit! Copy, paste, flip, flip. is the three commands that are there. There, that is their best friend for this movie right here. <laughs> Smack it up, flip it, copy, yeah, and paste, copy it. and paste, and flip it, rub flip it, it down, around, rub it down. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> They copy and paste every goddamn thing in this movie, man. Starting uh, with these eyebrows. That's the first thing you're going to notice. Billy, I want you to look at this monitor over here all right. and tell me what you see. All right. Right now? Yeah. I see Disney's Pixar's Onward, March 6th. What was that? March 6th. March 6th. Now, I want you to behold right here. Homeward. When did that come out? February 25th. <laughs> 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 they got the jump on those bitches, man. Yeah. And guess what? They ain't finished it yet. They just put, uh, hey, that's well, before March, right? You, you better copy, paste it, and flip it around. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. They're like, guys, the only way this works is if we can beat them to market. Yeah. <laughs> they beat them by... <laughs> Nobody leaves this room. They beat them by two weeks. Right, right, yeah. Nobody leaves this room until this shit is done. <laughs> Here's some pizza. Some... some <laughs> a couple of drinks and y'all gonna get y'all gonna do this. <laughs> now go to sleep. This, ladies and gentlemen, is why I want to come in and point out the brilliance of Asylum. When Asylum ain't even got a full movie to work with, they find a way. That's all they need. They find a way around that shit, That's man. Right. I want y'all. To, this is where I went through and just started like pinpointing, taking notes. I looked at how they did it. They had a trailer to work with. They didn't have a movie, so they can't rip the whole movie off. So what did they do? They noticed certain things in the trailer. First of all, they looked at the trailer for Onward. They said, all right, you know what? It's obvious that these two dudes right here, these these brothers, these brother elves over here, they are going on a heartfelt road trip. And let me see here. Silent Sam, you know what? That's funny. We going on a road trip too. <laughs> they, they did. They did the same exact thing. Did they start uh, uh, onward in like the olden times too? Yep. <laughs> yep. They, they sure did. This did. One too, right? Yep. Because that's what it looked like from the trailer. They sure did. Uh, there's a part in the trailer where <laughs> they uh, they have uh, car trouble. Out of gas. They run out of gas. No, that work. You can remember the scene where they play with the gas container to make it bigger and oh yeah 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 you know this so this right here y'all remember this part so I I, I didn't have the sound though because I don't think I needed it at first but I'm like you know what let me let y'all get very re- uh, familiarized with this growth spell we grow the can and then the gas inside will grow with it now they say you know what uh in onward they say hey you know what we uh. I think we having a little car trouble too. Ain't what? That, ain't, that coinc- ain't that a coincidence? Don't go. She's going to kill you. I didn't think this through. Hi. Are you okay? <laughs> Your big route wreck and route rip off looking ass. <laughs> Who's he talking to? So they had. I'll tell you who they talking to. Oh, so shit. did you notice this? So they 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 uh, and let me see, man. I didn't have the clip up, but I want to show you something here, just so you can see how much they really are trying to get people. To be confused with this. When I was talking about the road trip, notice how they try to actually as safe as possible. Let me pull this out here. As safely as possible, they are trying to do the same thing. 
So notice that how they showed those two brothers going off into the distance. Mm. Uh, when we watched it, here, I'll, you know, uh, I want to show it to you one more time. You can see it right here. So you saw in the original trailer where they went off to the distance on their great road trip. The people, the people that are having car trouble in this are actually car driving frogs. Yay! The big monster's going to help us. Except they're not frogs. That's that's a goddamn lizard. Yeah. Yeah. That that yeah, is that's a frog. I, I, I didn't get that. I think that's a. Oh, excuse her. My daughter has the manner of a tadpole. That, that's not, that a is not a frog. So I can that's only a, that's a chameleon or a lizard. Yeah, or yeah, the gecko yeah, lizard. Gecko. <laughs> you know, yeah. what I mean? that's the only thing I can assume that y'all are just ripping off everything because that makes no sense. Right. He even has like the fingers, like the sticky fingers, like lizards do. Yeah. Look, look, look at the fingers. They have those 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 things on there. The 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 ones in the homeward or whatever. See, look. They sure do. Yeah. They know that it's weird, and they have a way to just one up you. They they keep it weirder than everything that you're thinking of. They they. Asylum is always one step ahead of you. Bye, Mr. Monster. Smile you later. Bye. So I guess if you're a frog, and you, maybe they are frogs. If you're a frog and you drive a you car, I guess yeah, the car huh? jumps too. Bye, Mr. Monster. Smile you later. <laughs> Why did that happen? Also, I don't exactly. Yeah, exactly. Wait, 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 wait. Go, 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 go back uh, just a little bit. Okay. When, when it dries off. Okay. Alan over here. Alan died. It's crazy. Stop. It's Stop. killing The sound effect is awful, too. <laughs> Mark, what are we look, looking for? Look at the Cholo hydraulics on this car. Oh, yeah. Well, what happened was they gave it some magic. So they gave oh. it. They gave they <laughs> they gave they it did. magic to blow up the tire. <laughs> so I guess they magic. gave it. They gave they gave it too much. Bye. Oh shit! Help us! <laughs> <laughs> did they explain that? He well, they show him blowing up the car and uh, the tires, and it just and, and but they don't they, and they don't show the animation of the tires actually getting big. Right. You just see the car kind of rise up, and then the uh, Lloyd the elf is like, "Well, I guess I used too much magic." And so there you no, go. No, but I'm saying bang. once it goes bang, does it does it follow up? No. no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it just goes away. Now, again, people, like I said, they looked at that trailer. They went through that shit with a fine tooth comb and said, what can we take from it? And, oh <laughs> everything. <laughs> everything. Just from that trailer. Onward, they got a convenience store. You got a problem, Shane? You know, Ugh. and this movie said, hey, you know what? Pull over. We need to get some gas and snacks, too. They also got a convenience store. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. That's the worst. That looks so bad. <laughs> that looks so and bad. Of course. Big and it's Eddie's a good convenience store that conveniently has bikers. Yeah, that, yeah I know. Hey. Do I wonder, the, the, do they, do they the, knock the, the bikes over? No, they don't do that. Oh, wow. At least they had enough originality to not do that. But they did take a bunch of little girls. <laughs> they had like witches over there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they said, you know, except our, our bikers are going to be regular size because we don't, we don't want to get sued. Right, orcs. Orcs, uh, yeah, orc bikers. If they, you know, if they got a convenience store, we got a convenience store. If they go on a road trip, we go on a road trip. If they got bikers, we got bikers. And they, they don't give a shit, man. And, and it's at this point, too. Oh, that's another thing. Oh, well, you know, at least they didn't have a diner in there. No, I'm sorry. The the, the convenience store actually <laughs> has a diner. It actually yeah, it actually functions as a diner, too. <laughs> what the f Well, you know, one has a manicure, this one has a cyclops. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah, they got they they combined the two. You saw Cyclops is in there, you got a manicure, they just combined the two. And we got that shit covered right there. They looked at yeah. everything and said, we don't have a full movie. We got a trailer. What can we do to sell this to unsuspecting <laughs> customers? And they did it. It is brilliant. It is, I'm telling you, it's amazing. So what happens when they no longer have any more trailer to work with? Oh, shit, you mean we got to make up a story on our own? That's when, they, that's when their weakness really shows. Martin, <laughs> Martin can tell you because they ain't got shit. Oh, no. Yes, they did. When they ran out of trailer, they went back to Avengers Endgame. <laughs> because 
Because if you go back to to where it started, to, to the very beginning, I will show you something that's so blatant. You'll be like, oh, how did I miss this before? Oh, you got to tell me what that is in a little while. Because the story that they come up with, because they don't have any story. All they had was a trailer. They just had a trailer to work with. Well, they got they got the, the the big guy, the big bad who wants to get an infinity stone. Sorry, uh, some a glowing gem. Oh, that is <laughs> so, that, so that he can have all the power. <laughs> that is that is true. He has to find two stones instead of six because we ain't got that much time. <laughs> we don't have much money. That is true, Martin. Like crew they got Martin is right. Staff. They got two stones. They got to get, and but <laughs> after that, the story is it don't. So it turns out that Barl. Takes for so I forget forget the even reason the, the reason even why they do it. Barl takes Lloyd's magic bag of of, of tricks and he, <laughs> and then the bikers realize like oh my god oh he he's magical oh he can help us do our crimes or whatever they're doing our or we can take him back to the big boss. Thing is, ah! so- Oh my god. So he wants to create a, oh a, a, a an army of zombie orcs. Okay. So he can take over Elf Town. Because <laughs> at one time orcs used to run shit and uh, those damn elves took the, they taken our taking all our shit now. I don't know. Oh, and you know Jesus. there's hardly any story. So at this point you ain't paying attention to the story. You just <laughs> you just pretty much just sitting back and just looking at how shitty the rest of this movie is. Oh, pretty Mainly much just it. looking at the at the shitty animation. And again, <laughs> they know. They know it's bad. So they they use it to their advantage. Now, I've okay. never seen somebody take shitty animation and turn it around and try to turn it into something. They tu- they make it a part of the story. <laughs> so they so so uh, they when 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 the bikers realize that Barl has powers, this is the power that amazes them. I think he's talking gibberish. Should I call a doctor? Whoa. He's going through metal. That's just bad rendering. He just, he, yeah. like, I, can, I can poke my hand through shit. Yeah, what do you think yeah man, that's, that's bad clipping throughout this movie. But the fact that they make it part of the story, they, <laughs> you, you, you almost have to applaud them for that. It's, yeah, it's, you know, we, we can't get around this, guys. This is making bad, us make it a part of it. There's so many, there's so much bad clipping in the movie, man. There's a, oh man, I don't even have it. There's a part where his, <laughs> where, let me see if I can find it. No, let oh, me find this shit. Do you notice how the slime, <laughs> like some of it pours off and some of it gets absorbed into the skin? <laughs> yes. <laughs> man, like, <laughs> like, like this right here. <laughs> they, they, they're, mad, they, they're amazed when his hand can go through metal. When they've missed all the other times that his hand has gone through all the other shit. Look oh, at <laughs> no. Oh, oh. oh, that's bad. So all the bad clipping in it, they just said, F- we, re- we recognize yeah. it. Just make it part of the story. I want you to notice something right here. Okay. I'm just going to, I'll just see if you can tell what's wrong with this scene. Uh, I'll play it for you again. He just disappeared. <laughs> uh, here, let me. Do it one more time. Just do it again. Okay. One more time. Okay, I'll tell you. Is Washington wrong. on the on the bill? I, yes, <laughs> it's supposed to be this elf world, and because that's a George that's Washington. a human <laughs> George, George Washington. Washington on the bill, that's yeah. an Earth dollar right there. <laughs> <laughs> Not to mention there's no f- candy in there. Ain't no candy in there. They, they didn't put no candy. They, how hard would it have been just to put pointy ears on George Washington? They're probably thinking like, oh well, no, they're behind his hair. The United States of America. <laughs> 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 wow. Not Elfdale. Not Elfdale. Not, not Elfland. Not New York City. Nah, you, the United States of America with George Washington, Washington. the founder of Elfdale. <laughs> <laughs> when humans roam the when earth. You, you with, a, you with a human on the dollar right there. <laughs> oh, and by the way, that vending machine with no, with no food in it, mm-hmm. uh, you know, Barl's dumb ass can't see it. And so when he <laughs> <laughs> he gets mad about it and treats us to another piece of terrible animation. The shit just stays oh. up there. It's like what? Is, how? Now is he always what? that strong, or is that because of magic? That's that's nothing. That's what? bad animation. It just stayed. It's, yeah. You know what it is? They didn't want to animate the shit crashing. That's what that's what that was. <laughs> Even Fast and Furious would look at this and be like, God damn, no <laughs> physics at all. <laughs> How can we do that? Okay. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> hey, somebody, somebody taking notes? <laughs> Could be family now. Take notes. 
Uh, there's scenes in here where Martin, did you notice this? Okay, watch this. See if you can see what's wrong with this scene. <laughs> I know this seems really bad, but did you see those letters? Oh, yeah, the letters are floating on this top seems of her jacket. Really bad. Those oh, letters oh, are not on her shit. jacket. Oh. I know this seems really bad. You got that right. You ain't lying, right. <laughs> <You ain't laughs> <lying>, bitch. <laughs> Look at this shit. I know this seems really bad. Magic, y'all. The <laughs> magical floating letters right there. <laughs> mm. There's a part in here where it's some, some, the animation is so bad that sometimes it just gets downright disturbing. There's a part in here they scared one of these bikers so bad they gave his ass a seizure. Look at this. Trying not to fix anything else. Oh, <laughs> <man>. <laughs> he just checked out. Oh. <laughs> That's so bad. He just said, I'm gone. Right. And that one, you don't have to go like, hey, can you, can you picture what's wrong with this? It's right there. It's right, right there. there for you. It's, it's right like, there. I, his, his head left his eyes behind. Yeah. <laughs> it took a while for his eyeballs to catch right. up. <laughs> Trying not to fix anything else. <laughs> <laughs> well, they, didn't, they didn't make the eyes go with the head. They just said, ah, f that's good enough. Hey, they can't. hey, man, you said you said we had to have this shit out by the 26th. <laughs> Jesus, Trying not to fix anything. I'm out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I told you guys already. Like, you saw, like, those two... Those two bald dudes that you saw, yeah, the, the mirror in images the mirror. Of each other. Like, you already saw the scene, but they they weren't even characters in the movie before. And by the time that the movie's about to get to its midpoint and about to wind up, they they just figured we'll just make a whole army of them. Right. Copy and paste. Copy oh. and paste. <laughs> that, that yeah, because that gang was only three people. The gang, yeah, and the then, gang, yeah, the gang was only gang, three people, um, and then all of a sudden they just said, them, yeah. and then and all of a sudden in the middle of the movie that that bald character came up, and they just we love that dude. We gonna we gonna yeah. we gonna make an army of them. We got plenty of them. By the time you get to the end, you're like, God damn it! All right, you got me. You almost have to admire the film, right? When you're about to give up on it, you gotta admire it because when they get to the end credits, that's when you realize this whole thing was animated by one person, Michael Johnson. Mm. Yeah. All animated, all animation created, des right. designed, and animated by Mike, Mike, Michael Johnson. While on so this a coat one, one dude sit in his bedroom doing all of Just this. Just doing yeah. this. In his drawers. In a, in a very short period of time. In a mm -hmm. very short period of time. <laughs> at one point, you're thinking like, at one, at one point, you're laughing at like, you're like, of course it was. It's bullshit. Yeah, it was. And then another point, you're thinking like, but no, I admire it because work ethic. And then the other, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and then the other part of it is, well, shit, should I feel for this guy? Did they have him chained up in a basement That's somewhere? Thing. Like, just take out food, just pile it up, and, <laughs> yeah. and, and two guys outside the door won't let him leave to finish it. Yeah, well, they, well you know, well, they, he couldn't see the sunlight until he finished yeah, his yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Y'all got to listen to the, to the, the these, these, these are the most generic ass lyrics I've ever heard. Just sitting here watching the world go by to let it pass you by. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Life is just a dot. Let them pass you by. Just sitting, watching the world go round. Air is blowing, we're breathing oxygen. I went to sleep last night, woke up this morning, had a On sandwich. Gala Gala Island. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, this is, uh, you know, it, it almost feels wrong to pick on this in as much as the fact you bring up this one guy doing all the animation and. Yeah, he couldn't have had a lot of time. No. Um, it's it's a it's a travesty. But at the same time, you look at it and you go, you know, there's no touches of brilliance. Like even a lot of times you see something bad or rushed, you can still see something in yeah. it where you go like, well, you know what? This could have been something. A little bit more time. This could have been something. A little bit more money. Yeah. This, this never had a shot at being anything. No, <laughs> not at all. No. I, 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 I think you could have gave this guy two years and a crew. And this would have only been about ten percent better. Yeah, there's, the, the, yeah, this, the, yeah, you're right. This was stillborn. It never had a chance. I, I do want to be a writer on this though. Just yeah. like, say, how bad can I make this shit? Oh well, sure, because because all you need is a stack of cocktail napkins and a couple of martinis and a pen. Yeah, and and the afternoon to yourself, and then boom, there you go. You can write on the napkins that your drink was on. Right. Exactly. <laughs> you know, they probably turn it all over to that Michael guy, and he's looking at him. He's like. Well, a lot of these are smeared. 
I know, man, but you know, just make something up. You, you, you're the artist here. Right. Just, you know, whatever you do, I'm sure is good. I, all right, you, you yeah. got it, baby. All right, we love you. Yeah, yeah, Bye yeah. Friday, though, don't forget that. <laughs> hey, better than the last stack of cocktail napkins I turned in, right? <laughs> that was had pee on them. There you go. <laughs> I had, a, I had a, I, I was Sorry. amazed. I had a fun time watching this. I am in utter res, I have utter respect for Silent Man. I know it's hard to say, but when I mean, listen, it's hard to have disrespect for somebody who don't give a. F- at your disrespect. <laughs> right? That's true. That's true. You can't make fun of somebody who doesn't give a shit. Yeah, all right. they're like, we don't care. We know. You can't make fun yeah, of Yeah, it's like if you, if you went to somebody and you said like, man, that movie you did, that was a piece of shit. And they went, uh-huh. And? Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, it really sucked. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um. Well, all right. Well, have a good day then. Yeah. <laughs> you too. <laughs> I, got, I got another shitty one on the way. <laughs> yeah. I just, well, uh, good job. Yeah, <laughs> yeah people. Homeward. It, it, not to be confused not, with yeah, Homeward. Not to, be com- not to be confused. Even he's confused. He's like, wait a minute, what movie? <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> huh? If your grandmom is telling you that she's getting you that latest Pixar movie with those blue ass elves, look for the H. Make sure, because if you see that H, that means you got the wrong film. Or the you know right what? One, it, it, the, the funny thing is, is that. Uh, uh, Oh, wait, I'm getting them confused. Onward wasn't even a big success. But they, but you know what? They made this before Onward was released. No, I know because they 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 had visions of that being huge and them riding the coattails. Oh, right, yeah. right. They thought that was gonna be yeah. They thought that was gonna be amazing. You know what'd be funny? Yeah, Onward tanked. Yeah. You you know what'd be funny though? Be funny if if if. If if home homeward made more money than homeward did, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that. They, they certainly spent less. They, they sure did. Probably make more of a profit. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Or eight profit.